Okay, so you want to have a custom entry for the degree day data because it's outside of the UK for this particular project that you're working on. So um, if the project is in France, for example, uh, you can type in France, or if you know the name of the town the city, you can, you can narrow it down there. But if I type in France, you'll see that it now enables me to select France here from the drop down box. Um, and uh, if I want to go to Paris, so I click on Paris, so I've got all these weather stations around Paris. Now the data that you ideally want to look for is uh, one with uh, three out of three stars and maximum blue. Three stars it means that the data quality is very good, very reliable, um, and also the blue bar means the amount of data they have, so how long in history it goes back to. And um, a little bit more information about uh, about what kind of which weather stations to select is listed here. And, as it says here, the airports are, uh, provide the best quality data as well, uh, and a little bit more explanation on the stars. Um, so um, let's click on the uh, this Paris airport here. Um, I wanted to make sure it's the heating because I'm providing a heating system, data set Celsius for temperature units. Base temperature is going to be 15.5, so that is the temperature at which I want the, the heating system to turn on. That is uh, from SIBC as well, so anything from the Domestic Heating Design Guide as well from the UK information is all based upon that 15.5 as the base temperature, so I recommend to use that still. We want an average as well, so ensure you always press on the average, so you want to have the degree day data over the course of uh, an average period and the longer the period the more accurate as well it's going to be clearly a better, better average so I'm going to go for five years um, so um, this will ensure we can provide a, a good a good estimate on on how much energy is going to be needed uh, over a course of a year for the for the property um, so that's why degree days data is important because it gives us that that kind of history for that particular town city area so it's downloading now um, so wait for before we'll wait until that download button is available okay so once the download is available so press the download button uh, and then open up your the Excel file and the information you're you're interested in is uh, not the individual months but in fact the total so that's that's what you're interested in here this figure here highlighted in yellow um, so that figure you can type in to heat engineer in the custom entry um, and ensure that you're typing in the location as well um, and that's it thank you